Hello, Assalamu alaikum everyone. Welcome to Zest and Zeal. Today we will learn about square root by prime factorization method. When the numbers are very small, like one digit number or two digit number, we can simply find out the square root. Like if the number is, if the number is nine, like we know that the nine is the uh, square root of 9 is 3 we, means when we multiply 3 by 3 we will get 9 if the number is 4 we know that square root of 4 is 2 2 multiplied by 2 is 4 the square root of two, uh, 4 is 2 if the number is 25 we know that 5 multiplied by 5 is 25 if the number is 49 we know that 7 multiplied by 7 means we know the square root mostly 1 till 10 or 11 or 12 okay but when the numbers are large like a two, three digit number of uh, four digit number or more than four digit number so it is very uh, difficult to remember the square root okay so let's start the square root by prime factorization method a number is question number one is one seven six four okay what is the way to find out the square root by prime factorization? First of all, uh, find out the prime factors of 1764. How to find out the prime factors? We have already learned how to find out the prime factor 1764. First of all, uh, see what is your unit digit number. Unit digit number is 4. If the unit digit number is 0 to 4, 6 and 8, it means that the number can be completely divided by 2, okay, 2, 8 times is 16, 16, 1 is remaining, 1 and 6 become 16, 2, 8 times is 16, 2, 2 is a 4, again it can be divided by 2, 2, 4 is a 8, 2, 4 is a 8 and 2, 1 is a 2, then 1, uh, 3, 4 for 1, the uh, unit place digit is 1 it means that it cannot be divided by 2 try with 3 3 1 time is 3 1 is remaining 14 3 4 time is 12 2 is remaining 2 and 1 become 21 3 7 time is 21 3 again uh, if uh, first number uh, is 3 it means the second number should be 3 when you are going to find out the square root if it is a complete square Okay, 3, 4 times is 12 and 2 is remaining, 3, 9 times is 27. Now, 49 can be divided by 7. 7, 7 times is 49 and 7, 1 time is 7. You can see that if the first number is 2, the second number is 2. If the first number is 3, the second number is 3. It means pairs come, coming up. Okay, it means that these are the prime factors. Okay, you are finding out the square root of 1, 7, 6, 4. This is the sign of the square root. Okay. The square root of prime factors of square root 2, 2, 3, 3, 7 and 7. What is the next? First step was you have to find out the prime factors. Second step is make pair. 2 and 2 make pair, 3 and 3 make pair and 7 and 7 make pair. Third step is take out the 1, 1, factor of each pair okay one seven six four one uh, one factor of each factor means two comes out three next number is three and then uh, yeah take out one one factor of each pair now multiply all these number two three times is six two three times is six six seven times is forty two it means that Square root of 1764 is 42. It means that if we multiply 42 by 42, you will get 1764. 42 multiply by 42, you will get 1764 or you can do it manually. Or you can check it manually. Okay. Next number. Next number is 11025. Okay. First of all, first step is take out the, find out the prime factors. Okay. 11025 okay now our unit place digit is 5 it means that it can be divided by 3 otherwise 5 
फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल चेक विथ ट्राई विथ थ्री ओके थ्री थ्री टाइम इज नाइन टू इज रिमेनिंग टू एंड जीरो विल बिकम ट्वेंटी थ्री सिक्स टाइम इज एटीन टू इज रिमेनिंग ट्वेंटी विल बिकम ट्वेंटी टू थ्री सेवन टाइम इज ट्वेंटी वन वन इज रिमेनिंग वन एंड फाइव बिकम फिफ्टीन थ्री फाइव टाइम इज फिफ्टीन इफ द फर्स्ट नंबर इज थ्री द सेकेंड नंबर शुड भी थ्री इट्स अ ट्रिक ओके थ्री वन टाइम इज थ्री थ्री टू टाइम इज सिक्स थ्री टू टाइम इज सिक्स वन इज रिमेनिंग वन एंड फाइव बिकम फिफ्टीन थ्री फाइव टाइम इज फिफ्टीन ओके नाउ थ्री फोर टाइम इज ट्वेल्व बट इट कैन नॉट बी डिवाइडेड बाई थ्री एनी मोर ओके और चेक विथ फाइव बिकॉज यूनिट प्लेस डिजिट इज फाइव फाइव टू टाइम इज टेन टू इज रिमेनिंग टू एंड टू बिकम ट्वेंटी टू फाइव फोर टाइम इज ट्वेंटी टू इज रिमेनिंग टू एंड फाइव बिकम ट्वेंटी फाइव 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 टाइम इज ट्वेंटी फाइव ओके नो फर्स्ट नंबर इज फाइव द सेकेंड नंबर शुड भी फाइव फाइव फोर टाइम इज ट्वेंटी फोर इज रिमेनिंग फोर एंड फाइव बिकम फोर्टी फाइव फाइव नाइन टाइम इज फोर्टी फाइव फोर्टी नाइन कैन बी डिवाइडेड बाई सेवन 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 टाइम इज फोर्टी नाइन एंड देन सेवन वन टाइम इज सेवन These are the pairs, uh, prime factors. Okay, you are finding out the square root. This is the sine of the square root one one zero two five. Write down all the prime factors three three five five, and then seven and seven. Second step is make pair, and then third step is take out one one factor of each pair. Take out three five and seven. and then multiply it 3 5 time is 15 and 15 7 time is 7 5 time is 35 7 1 time is 7 and 3 10 1 0 5 it means that 1 1 0 2 5 square root of 1 1 0 2 5 is 1 0 5 if we multiply 1 0 5 By one zero five, we will get one one zero two five. It means that our answer is correct. Okay, you can check it by multiply one zero five by one zero five. Okay, third number is three six double zero. Okay, first of all, take out the prime factors three six double zero. Okay, unit place digit is zero. It means that it can be divided by two. Two one time is two one is remaining six one and six becomes sixteen two eight time is sixteen zero comes on directly okay now two nine time is eighteen zero and zero as it is again two four time is eight one and zero become ten two four two five times ten and zero units place is zero still it can be divided by two. Two two time is four. Two two time is four. One is remaining. Two five time is ten. Now unit place digit is five. It can be divided by three or five. First of all, try with three. One by one. Uh, um, move to the greater number. Step by step, move to the greater number. Two three. Then move to the another number four and five. Okay. Three seven time is twenty one. One is remaining. Three five time is fifteen. If the first number is three, second number should be three. Three two time is six. Three five time is fifteen. Now twenty five can be divided by five. Five five time is twenty five, and then five one time is five. Okay, these are the prime factors. Now what you have, what you have to do it. Write down all the prime factors of three six double zero. Two 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 two. Three three and. Five and five, make pairs. Now, then, take out one one factor of each pair. Two, then two, then three, and then five, and multiply all these number. Two two is a four, four three is a twelve, and twelve five times is sixty. Check it. Yes, it's sixty. It means that square root of three six double zero is sixty. Okay, I hope you have understood the square root by the prime factorization method. In the next video, we will learn, inshallah, square root by the uh, division method. Okay, keep watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe the video. Allah Hafiz.